everybody on there. Thank you so much. Here we go. The lore. I don't know if that was enough stickers. Long ago, before humanity came into existence. I missed a line already. Descending unto this place, she came from the sky. One unto this world. Trapped alone, she cries. Let me return home to heaven. Well, we didn't quite do that. It is where I belong. Children, please help me. Children, send me back home. Children, for this reason you were born. That is the day that humanity was born, and when they angered her, they were destroyed. After several ages of destruction, the story begins. She's not suffering anymore. We did send her to heaven, kind of. What was your favorite moments? Mine was snakes with legs, as we all know. I don't even know right now. I can't think. Okay, so this stays here. Which... We knew it would. Let's go hang out in the puddle while I catch up on some chats. If La Mulana was a good game, it would have an ending where we could replace Laser Baby and take our rightful place in Skelemom's arms. Um, I saw a question about Classic. I don't think I'll be playing Classic anytime soon, maybe someday, but it's not high on my priorities list. I'd say DC's playthrough of Hell Temple had a negative effect on the game's reputation. Hell Temple is really not what La Mulana is about. Interesting. Yeah, we, um, we have some other stuff we could do today. And Sunday. I gotta decide what I want to save for Sunday or if we just cram it all into one day. Thank you so much for that hype train. I really appreciate it. Thank you for the love. Thank you for the hype over this playthrough. Those of you that already knew La Mulana and found me through it, you get it. And I'm so grateful to have met you all. For those of you that knew me before La Mulana and were like, I don't understand what the heck is this game, but came along anyways, thank you. Thanks for the love. No thoughts, only, only snakes with legs. My my favorite parts, my favorite moments were still heart scales puzzle way up there. Um this Mulbrook remembering Mulbrook and like knowing that she had told me once on an off chance she had a dream that her room had an exit to the surface and that ended up helping. Like, that's... We needed that info. Amazing. Um... God, favorite moments? Other than those two? I don't... I don't know. My favorite moments were the shameless trolls of Trio and Palenque. Yeah, some of the boss trolls were so good. And when you're ready to go through this again, there's La Mulana 2. I had no idea where to go during the escape. Of course, I went to the first main entrance. Yeah, so what happens if you go to the first main entrance? You die? I'm still incredibly impressed about how thorough you were with notes and noticing so many details. Terabyte, thank you. I appreciate it. All other entrances are blocked. Wow. Wow. My favorite moments have been any time you've stopped dead and stared at the camera and said, really? <laughs> Through gritted teeth. <sighs> oh my god. No May, no Bahamut. No surface through Hell's Gatekeepers. No surface through Inferno. Where does the other side of that one come out? Those are the, those are the only entrances. Llama, we did it! We did it! It happened! 
We're just hanging out in the puddle while we talk. My safe place. Thank you for the congrats. And the gates don't work. So no bottom of a... Uh... <laughs> Hell's Gatekeeper path was always closed off. Yeah. Surface through Hell's Gatekeeper if you could get there. Okay. Even if you could, there's problems. Oh, Tower of Goddess. Yeah, that would be weird to get to. Hot tub la Mulana de-stressing. Oh yeah, let me, um... Well, I'll, I'll change the stream title in a minute. That's not important right now. We just need to figure out what we're gonna do. Sad I missed it, I was at the store. Vods is a blessing. Llama, we beat her. We beat the final boss. And then there's an escape sequence, which like I kind of anticipated, but I was not looking forward to if it had the timer the same way Metroid does. And we died in the escape, but it was really close. And then we beat the boss again, the next try. You can fall in the hole in the corridor. It's a shortcut. Oh, I was too I was too scared to try it. Has anyone explained mantra puzzle? Not yet. No, pu no puzzle answers yet, please. Um, we'll stick to the safe word rules for now, just because we're like, there's too many things to take in right now. Um, spoiler chat, you said you had ideas of what else to do today. The speedrun glitches to the surface and then have to glitch back into the ruins. Whoa, cool. Hi, Seer. I don't think I said hi. I'm so glad she didn't try it. It was so much more exciting. Oh, yeah. Want to try to open Hell Temple, at least have a look. Yes. I think that's what we'll try. Devarian, welcome in. You could try pulling out the on the Mulbrook's dad thread. Yeah, there's that and the other... Can... Safe word, yes, no. Can I get the other angel shield? Is it even possible or does it lock out once you get one of them? It's a good escape. There's more routes than you'd expect. Where does that door in um, Corridor go? Doesn't that go back into the shrine of the mother? Unless you're a Seer Sky Gamer and have to break into the ruins to get to Mulbrook because mom has suddenly died of a heart attack? Huh? That's one way to describe true any percent. It's a backup in case you didn't get the first. You cannot. Okay. We could go visit the developers. I have software for like, there's a software combo for developer messages, right? It just says sold out. Oh, it's a shop. Where? Which one is the twisted place and which one is the deception? When you leave Corridor, you had time to sightsee. If you had time to sightsee, you'd see the roof is broken. So the one in the bottom wraps around to the top. I, mi I missed that. See, your sky glitched the game so hard the game was over in a hair over four minutes. What? There's a speedrun route I came up with that does memory exploits to set the flag that triggers the escape. Me and worse than you. Oh, nice. That's that. That's wild. That breaks my brain. The fake silver shield is the deception. What? But there's two silver shields and two angel shields, I thought. Uh, and Melison, welcome in. Thank you. We won. Terabyte, thank you so much for gifting a sub. I'm saying your name wrong, I'm sure. I'm sorry. Thank you, Terabyte. Enjoy that Earth Badge emotes ad previewing. We're so glad to have you. Void Lily, hi, welcome in. One silver shield is fake. Gets replaced with angel shield once 11 children are dead. So there's not two angel shields? The, the thing says two shield, angel shields shining golden. Why are there two silver shields and only one angel shield? It will be hard to beat your 82 hour, 59 minute record. <laughs> yeah. Aww, that's so sweet. Can't believe my GF gifted me a sub. Wholesome. There's only one silver shield. The one you buy is fake and worse than the buckler. Okay, there's a fake and a real. We're getting very, yes. 
forget the silver shield. I'm not asking about the silver shield anyway. I was told one of them was the fairy clothes, just a weird translation. The angel shield is the fake silver shield atop the- Well then, yeah, the, the writing says there are two angel shields shining golden. But there's only one. I'm not asking about the silver shield. You all are like, it's the silver shield. No! <laughs> you can fail the puzzle to get the angel shield in dimensional, but it's required to beat the game, so if you fail the puzzle, you can buy it in the shop. Which, what shop? We're, we're talking in circles here. The same shop that the fake silver shield is in? Momo shop. Leg eater. Thank you, Petrie. <laughs> now we got there. And thank you, Chaos. And thank you, Terabyte. I think probably chat delay was not helping us either. Phew. Okay, solve that mystery. So there's not two riddles. There is only the riddle in Dimensional Corridor. If you fail it, there is a backup you can buy. That was a big mystery to me. Okay, so then I need to figure out the weird underwater door in Tower of the Goddess and the weird upside down door in Gate of Illusion, which I think is Mulbrook's dad. Maybe both of them, because it sounds like Mulbrook's dad is like a whole quest. Maybe you have to go multiple places. Don't answer that yet. Um, What are my other burn- Oh yeah, the burning question about the mantra puzzle. I still haven't come up with anything. Just wait wait until Sunday for that one, I think. Um, let's, let's, let's visit the developers. Safe word, let's go hang out with the developers. Somebody mentioned that, and that sounds like a very chill, fun post-game thing that doesn't require very many brain cells. Miracle and Mirai, let's unequip everything. Let's get my maps back. I'm going to use human technique of keeping a notebook if I ever do La Mulana 2. I haven't decided if I want to keep doing handwritten or just go fully into my Obsidian notes for La Mulana 2. We will be playing La Mulana 2, just not for a while. You've seen one developer room so far? Oh, is it the one by the the ladder on the surface? Or is it just Gate of Time? Or neither. I entered it yesterday once? Huh? <laughs> it's very notebook worthy. Digital notes have always failed me compared to physical media. Interesting. It screamed at you. Oh my god, Churyo's room is a developer room? Fun. Do we go back there with the software equipped? Safe word? I made a whole Discord channel just for La Mulana 2 screen caps of tablets. Amazing. Okay, I am gonna change the stream info now. Thank you all again for the post-game hype. Thank you for all the Marducks. On break, I will get everybody's name on there. And, uh... I Beat It is our stream title. Post-game chats and exploring. La Mulana, I guess if that wasn't obvious. Oh, 
was so much fun to take part in it. Thank you, spoiler chat, for helping with all of the nudges along the way. Um... I don't know. I will I will spend some time to reflect when I'm not immediately post boss fight. And like really sit down and think about what we've accomplished. I need this tab. I need this tab. I need this tab. Now my menu is back to normal. Luz, welcome in! We did it! We did it. It was- it was very good. I hope- I- we're coming down off of the victory energy. Spoiler Chat did a fine job. I delivered the nudges, but there's been going on so much behind the scenes. Yeah. Hi, Duplex. I have done practically nothing in terms of this PC version. Pretty much just rummaging in the back. And you're thinking, if that's the case, why are you writing this? Well, Nagoro likes to be as close to the players as possible. Thus, this message fulfills some sort of need, I guess. If you're wondering just how close Nagoro is to its players, let me give you an example. In this version of La Mulana, press one button and assume the shield stance and your shield stays out. This is the result of a comment we received on our website from a player of the previous version of the game. We thought, if we could just make one player happy, that would be something. And so we did it. That's what Nagoro is all about. At some point, we'd like to be able to show the messages we've received from players in our games. Anyway, see you next time. Yes, we we changed so many things from the original game to this one because of feedback from our players. Petalol, thank you for the GG. Duplex, that cell put backwards. <laughs> La Mulana, we made a single person happy and then stopped. Next developer. Yes. Do you remember where you got the axe? Yes. Make one player happy, make thousands suffer. Complimentary. Suffer in the best way. Okay, good enough. Excuse me. Oh, I wonder if I can, um... You know what I learned? I think I got- I spoiled myself on a trio technique because I am making that video. But the axe staggers trio eventually, and I never knew that, and I didn't do it. So I wonder if there's other enemies that the axe will stagger. I know it staggers the elephants in Chamber of Birth, but I got it so late that I missed a lot of stuff that the axe does. Okay, this is where I got it. Sir Dob of Power. There's a breakable floor. Fun. Speaking of Chamber of Birth. To our regulars, hello there! To our new players, pleased to meet you! I'm Saimeru. I handle programming and sound. Somehow all the programming this time fell on poor little me, so if there's any odd bits, I'm sorry about that. The WiiWare version of La Mulana perfectly programmed for the Wii, really making use of all the capabilities of the Wii. Thus, in order to make the transition to the PC version, the core had to be completely reconfigured. It was a lot more trouble than we thought it would be. We thought, if we're going to go all this trouble anyway, we may as well take it even further and added the ability to change the language, graphics, and sound, widescreen display support, and even the ability to go 
to go to hell in the beginning. <laughs> Plus, we've completely revamped time attack mode. The look hasn't really changed, but the content is different. Oh yeah, are we doing that? Wonder what we'll make next. See you next time. Big shout out to all the chatters who's gotten message deleted by the mods and Bitter Trooper. Thanks for understanding. People are flawed and many messages look like spoilers if you're on edge. Thank you, Llama. Thank you, mod team. Absolutely echoing that. Like, for those of you who got a message deleted and you're like, why the heck did that get deleted? It's just how blind playthroughs are sometimes and spoiler-free playthroughs. Better safe than sorry. Um... And you came right back, and you kept chatting and watching, so I appreciate I appreciate the understanding that everybody makes mistakes, but also, like, some things that we consider spoilers, other people might not. You know. It's been really, it's been really good. We have not had too much, like, resistance or, like, anger over spo uh, modding this game. Saimiru is Lameza spelled backwards! Lameza! Thank you for thanking the mods, all the love. Presumably by odd bits, he means a single whistle. <laughs> this is cute. Okay, next one. How many are there? Oops. <laughs> Hello there. One left. You may guess which one. Um, who's left? I don't know. I don't have any brain cells left right now. Lumeza, Zelpud, Mulbrook, Lamulana. Time to not go to Goddess looking at the Collapse Tower, but the Collapse Goddess looking at the tower. Okay. This one? Inside the statue? Oh my god. <laughs> Hello there, Naramura, boss of everyone here. I'm the one who thought up this game and added all the new irritating traps. Originally created as an amateur PC game, the remake is now being released again as a PC game. To all of you who fell victim to our merciless traps that swoop down on you when you least expect it, I say congratulations. To all of you who kept thinking, do I really have to beat this guy to move on to the next level? And kept being killed by the same monster, I say thank you. That's right, this is Naramura, the father of La Mulana. Har har har. La Mulana is standing up for Japanese indie games worldwide. I would love to see this game really get people into Japanese indie games. But it's sort of unclear as to how much a game that can only be enjoyed by people who like the idea of being killed over and over by the father of the ruins can contribute. Ha 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 ha. Aww. Wait, you just came up with that and you were joking, Cassie? No! <laughs> it's a whole thing. <laughs> this is so weirdly touching to read. It's This is perfect. There are dozens of us. There is certainly a following. This is the best little sprite. Blech. I want this as an emote, as an emoji. Now what? Ooh. What happens if you go in that room without the software? Just weird, um corridor music 
Reminder, in 2011-2012, the Souls games and you died hadn't really taken off yet. That wasn't- that wasn't ingrained yet? Oh my goodness. Yeah, it is similar, like, trolley traps to, um, to souls, I guess. I hate and love the sprite. Same as the other dev rooms. They're empty, nothing. Just a weird empty room. But the other one screams. Cave story. I Maybe I should try cave story again now that I've played this. I did not stick with it more than one stream. It did not connect for me. You love Cave Story? Oh my gosh. It's one of your favorites? Ten years since you've played it? We played it for one day. God, I don't even remember. In 2021? And something happened that, like, I got stuck. And I just, I don't know, there was, like, no hype for it. I wasn't really having a good time. I don't think it felt good to play. Maybe it was controls like this, and I needed to give it more than one day. Oh, it's hard giving the Dirtbag publisher money. Ooh. Uh, it's got the most heart, the most feels, the most cave. The original indie hit. It's not super easy to find the original freeware. I don't remember how I came across it. If it was gifted, if I bought it, if it was in a bundle. It's been so long. I don't have the original. I have some kind of a remake something or other. The remake is published by not great people, though I played it well before I learned that. I I don't think I don't think I knew that. I don't I don't know that we talked about that on the channel when I played it. I'm not sure. Maybe we did. I should go find the VOD. I don't even think I made a highlight of it. Alright. Do we wanna pull at um the Mulbrook's dad thread? Like start that? Do, do, do. Does spoiler chat have any more requests or are we going to hell? <laughs> you were pretty put off by Cave Store. You couldn't reach the life upgrades and were stuck with one hit kills. Yeah, I hate that. I'm, I'm not a fan of one hit kills. That's why I didn't finish Gato Roboto either. And I think I even played Cave Story on easy mode. Or did I play it on regular and then regret playing it on regular? I don't remember. Something about the difficulty. Vote for Mulbrook's dad. One in chat if you would like to see Mulbrook's dad. Or see me do that puzzle attempt. What music should we listen to while I sit here and chat? Let's go to a classic. Um, I'll just leave the volume where it's at. Nicholas, the publisher of Cave Story, wrote the contract such that they non-own, now own, the IP and DMCA the creator for doing art expanded story. They also semi-deliberately blocked La Mulana coming to the West when they were originally going to handle its publishing. Whoa. We're going to hell. Time to visit Mulbrook's dad, the funniest thing I ever saw in this type of game. If you're on Linux, you can get to what looks like OG freeware on Flathub. Interesting. And try to blame the issues on Nagoro? Dang, I didn't know. They ghosted the devs? I vote for sticking your head into hell and then leaving. I had no idea either. That sucks. All right. Um, where? Okay, we're we're getting we're getting hit with our break anyway. So maybe when we come back, 
I stick my head in to hell, hell temple, poke my head in, go hi. And then if spoiler chat needs to give me a nudge to start the Mulbrook's dad quest, we can kick that off as soon as break is over. Thanks for the one. One. Thanks for the people who did ones in chat. We're, there's a lot going on. Fortunately, they forgot the time zones were a thing and missed the devs low-key putting them on blast, which led to full-on putting them on blast and the re release announcement. Thankfully, time zones. Whoever thought I would be thankful for time zones? The Mulberg's dad quest was not designed to be solved by one person. Okay, well, that's fine. I mean, without giving anything away, like... <laughs> can... What... What can you tell me that we can... Give me something to work on for Sunday, then? You can also save in a state where it cannot be com completed. Interesting. Had good ideas already. Okay. Um, I'll think about that on break. I'll think about it on break. We're going to get hit with an ad. So I'm going to play it so this does not get interrupted. And I will see you very soon. Thanks, everybody. I'm excited for post-game stuff. Here, I'll turn this back up. Welcome back. Okay. So, let's go poke our head into Hell Temple. How do I get there? Why isn't it next to Hell's Gatekeepers? I full on thought that that was like the pre-boss fight temple. That we were gonna fight Tiamat. And then we were gonna go to Hell. And then we were gonna fight the Mother. I was shocked. We're gonna, we're just, I'm gonna poke my head in, and then we're gonna try the other thing. And then Sunday, I think Sunday is mostly going to be, um, about the lore. And puzzles. I went back and watched the VOD for the win. Going into the last phase of Mom with 125 HP and making it through is impressive. Thanks, Radomero. Thank you, thank you. I am pleased. I am proud of myself. Do -do 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 -do. Especially after especially after yesterday being as tough as it was and getting really discouraged by getting to that phase with low HP. I every time I was like, ah, I need to get here with more HP and it turned out no. That was just how my runs ended up being. If no one has recommended uh, Author Blues, the complete and unabridged lore of La Mulan, it's fantastic. Watch, listen. Yeah. Yeah. I need to watch it. I need to watch some other playthroughs and speedruns and stuff um it'll be cool pretty much every boss is a tough fight if it's but it's very learnable which is something i really like i will say that like we talked about trio a lot today if i was in it for the boss fights and was more dedicated in figuring them out the shield stagger thing, however that works, that's a really cool... That would have felt good to solve instead of just using gun for that fight. Um, if I had to do it again and be more patient with boss fights and, like, actually get good at them, then I would have felt even more proud about myself. But the thing I love about Mo La Mulana is it has... <laughs> it has a gun. 
you don't have to strategize the boss fights. And that was the thing I think I was most nervous for was, you know, souls like bosses that were stuck there for streams and streams and streams and streams. We still spent 40 streams on this game, but it was the exploration, it was the riddles. It's just the length of the game. Vi is rough, yeah. Wait, Vi, I didn't end up using the gun. But there's gotta be a better way. La Mulana exists in the same space as Souls games for me. They do not respect you, do not respect them. Shoot that gun. <laughs> Spoiler chat has some hints of unknown origin, stolen with permission, but the name has never been noted. What? Myster very mysterious. What did we steal with permission? That vaguely... That does something in my brain. Oh, that's not the hint. I thought that was the hint. That was very confusing. We've got hints for Hell Temple but can't take credit for them. Oh, okay. Why? Did we steal something in game? Did we take something and then get to keep it? Didn't we? I heart fraud. The trick to buy is get the lamp, ring, and caltrops first and just not fight him. Cool. <laughs> I was naughty person and did not notate the name of the person who wrote the hints. Oh. Who I said I'm stealing these and they said, sure, go ahead. All right. I, s I swear there was some item that gave me an ability. It must have been the fraud person. What did we take from them? I don't know. W what's the hint? <laughs> Safe word. Should we start with the first or was your plan to look all over the ruins? No, no. Let's start with the first. Seek out guidance here. Pit below. Pit since sinister? Wait, what? I recently went back to watch the reveal of Vi because the music is so cool. The only fraud thing in the game is fake silver shield. Yeah. Do not save or enter shops unless that's what you need to do. Do not save. Wait, what? It's not real? What's not real? You can ignore that warning? Okay. So, write it, cross it out. Let me go back up. Seek out guidance with a capital G. Here. Pit. Below. Is that supposed to be sinister? Yawning. Ma's wisdom. Does anyone find this place on accident? Or like... One, does anyone find this place on accident? Two, does anyone find this place in a blind playthrough? Absolutely not. You'll see how impossible it is. Okay, cool. I've seen one person work it out blind. Cool. Pieces of it found by luck. Cool. Sorry, I missed. Is it sinister or sinster? 
I didn't see an answer to that. Hi, Doctor Who. Welcome in. How's it going? Thank you for the game. I appreciate it. Doctor Who gifted Monument Valley 2. I feel like you would win the lottery before finding it blind. Was released with instructions and in classic. Interesting. It's pure what the hell in some of the steps to go there. Literal what the hell. Okay, I'm writing Sinster, but I still don't know. A monumental achievement. We did it. We beat it. I need my maps. Graph paper ASMR. Map time! Are there any other, um... Don't tell me what they are, but are there any other big puzzles besides the mantras that people are waiting to reveal? So, is there something else that I brute forced besides that one? That's the biggest one I can think of. And then I guess some of the boss strategies would be cool to go back. We've, we've already talked about it a little. Pit of the Holy Grail. So let's go there. You brute force the second endless corridor. Oh, right. Yeah, did we ever talk about how to actually solve that one? Thank you. Thanks for the congrats. It was something. It was stressful, but it was cool. It was rewarding. I escaped. I actually did the escape. Want me to spill the beans or should I wait for Sunday? For the corridor one? Um... I don't know. <laughs> I feel like it looked like I was about to walk through there and then I didn't end up walking through there. Sunday it is. Yeah, let's just do Sunday. It was the something. <laughs> we started to and put it off till later. All right, we'll keep putting it off then. Bahamut has a cool quick kill in the speed run. Oh. Fishies, thanks for the congrats. We did it. It was, uh... I'm just gonna keep repeating myself. Where's... Solid Grey Fox, welcome in. How's it going? I don't have room for the Glyph Reader? Oh, because of Miracle. Oh, well this isn't even a skeleton that talks to me. You know what else is bothering me? Descend, jump up, and strike. Descend, go forward, that thing. I didn't say safe word though. <laughs> didn't you want to watch me do <laughs> weird 
corkboard theories about what it actually was for a little bit longer. Why are you so quick to correct me? <laughs> it went well today. Yeah, it's, it's it's been a good day. Thanks, Gray Fox. The clue followed me the entire game. Because I feel like I got it after I got the bronze mirror. The hint has been haunting spoiler chat. I, the other day I was like, I think I'm supposed to go into a screen transition and do it. I think that's the answer. Am I doing what? Safe word? Yeah. Safe word rules still apply. Somebody asked what we're working on. Um, Fishy's asked what we're working on. We're going to Hell Temple. But we're not gonna stay for long, and then we're gonna talk about hints for Mulbrook's dad. Except, apparently that's like a collaborative puzzle, maybe? Question mark? Corkboard, corkboard. You had already gotten flares. Yeah, we already had flares. You immediately posited that theorem and decided, nah, that can't be right. <laughs> Classic Jen. Oh, the Holy Grail. This makes the game. Obviously, you have to have it to beat the game. But I would not have played this if it didn't have some kind of a warp save function. And what else makes the game? I forget. That's the main thing. Mulberg's dad is some nonsense. It was meant as an a ARG style. Everyone solves together. What does ARG stand for? So my hint is... Seek out guidance here, pit below, pit sinister, sinister, sinister. I still don't have an answer on that. Yawning Ma's wisdom. Thank you, Chaos. I'm sorry. It was just gonna bother me. I don't know. I read into everything. Alternate reality game. Oh. Arg is the sound you make after you figure it out. <laughs> it's the sort of thing where you get a bunch of weird cryptic clues and the whole community comes together to pick through the nonsense. I like it. How did Mulbrook phrase it again? Um... A community. <laughs> Playing a thing that is with digital and reality. Sinister comes from a Latin word meaning on the left side. Unlucky. Inauspicious. Thank you, Indy. <laughs> I'm just standing here. Destroying these bubbles. Yawning Ma's wisdom. This is also Pit of the Holy Grail, right? Yeah. Can I enter into the Yawning Maw? No, this is also Pit of the Holy Grail. It's three rooms. Us left-handed people are quite sinister. Augmented reality versus alternate reality game. Gonna keep going back and forth a couple screens. This is gonna be this is gonna be a whole thing, isn't it?
a whole lot of not knowing. Yawning Maw. It might be augmented instead of alternate. Either way, acronym doesn't really fit with what it is. Gets fun with older games, or at least one of them. Lufia 2, Rise of Sinistrals. Wait, what's going on with Left Handed? Why are they rising up? Those of us who are left handed because ambidextrousness takes too much effort, can we be sinister? God, I don't even know where to begin with this. I'm going in here. The spirits will awaken at a later at that time. The onk of these lands lies beyond the path of the gazing faces and the jewels at the foot of the cliff of radiance. This is old news. Okay, maybe it's not in the pit of I don't think there's any other pits. Pit of despair! Oh yeah, there's a pit of despair. That's not here though. Ha! What is this one? Monument of Owens. Why is Owens here? It's so weird. What are you doing? Reading this, thinking it's something. Is Duncan in here? Yeah, Duncan's in here sleeping. He was very cute at the beginning of stream. I mean, he's always cute. But he really wanted to hang out. Is this a pit? This is all Monument of Time stuff. I don't know. For something that I just want to poke my head in, I kind of just want to go there. Yeah, let's do the next one. Let's do the next one. We're post-game. Easier hints. I mean, sort of post-game, except for the stuff we don't want to do yet. <laughs> God, remember when I was running out of here trying to escape because the ruins were being destroyed? Stressful. You need to go into a place you didn't think you can. You don't think you can. Okay, which is, I was thinking of, okay, let me be more thorough with my idea. Well, that one is blocked. You can't go inside there. 
And there's no mouth up here. Mulbrook says something like that, and I've been talking about, um, the door, the upside-down door in Gate of Illusions, and the door underwater. Oh my god. Stop. That blob gets me every time the door underwater and tower of the goddess <laughs> so let's go back to except what is the hint that you all gave me have to do with those places this isn't a pit let me go through this door real quick Do you walk? It feels like you walk through one of the mouths and come out the other side and th in this place, but it's gonna be upside down. And the only- is the clue for Mulbrook the only- in-game clue for this. What just happened? I looked away. I thought everything was normal that I was just going through this door. This is a bug? I can't go back through it. Well, obviously it's a bug. Something is wrong, but it's a known bug. Fun. Can I get on this ledge? Nice. I teleported you to the location of the other door, but the same screen. Okay, I fixed it. Weird. We got the Palenque crash. We got the Gate of Illusions bug. We got... Trio used gun. What other rare stuff did we get? I don't know. I feel like this is supposed to be a door. Oh, I'm gonna die. Puddle break. There was a stun lock in Mother's Fight you did avoid. Oh god, yeah. I would have been pissed. The game has some logic to not reload a screen if the warp goes to the same screen, but they never told the object what screen it was on. I got through escape without the shortcut. Oh, you know what? Oh, you know what else I want to talk about is the, um... That screen, the dolphin room in Mausoleum. I never, I never got trapped in there. Those who plunder the red light, the, the Ankh jewel room. And I never got, tr I never fought Chiryo when Chiryo was being regenerated by the maidens. There's a few things. There's several things. A lot of people don't get trapped there. And that hint was bothering me for so long until finally, the the week that I didn't really, I only streamed this on Monday because I got stuck on the mantras. Uh, I was going back through stuff and I went to, I was like, all right, I'm finally gonna go back to that VOD and see. And sure enough, I was like, oh, I broke this a long time ago. And I broke it before I ever opened the the treasure chest. So that's when I kind of knew. It's pretty ineffective, yeah.
Effective for people who don't have a holy grail. True. Oh yeah, and there's the trap in... Um... Sun Temple. That feels like years ago. It's like day one stuff. When you first walk in, the one to get the map. Okay, is the first part of this supposed to be Pit of the Holy Grail? Gate of Guidance? Pit of Holy Grail? Or is it something else? What other pit? There's a bunch of pits. It's not a room name. Okay. Thank you. Door to Eden. Being zipped in the ceiling is so funny. My second run that happened. If you get hit by laser beam as it spawns, you can get trapped in the ceiling because it zips you up. Find me. My name is Dracuet. I am the one who could not become a philosopher. You are a stone, a headstone. I think you're dead. No, you turned to stone to sleep better. <laughs> do 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 do. Mulbrook's dad. One who could not become a philosopher. It's like this kind of a symbol, like a like some horns and then like a diamond. Like that kind of. I created a treasure, but it was acknowledged by none, and thus I failed to become a philosopher. It is forbidden treasure that should neither be seen nor used. Should you seek it, visit me here. We're gonna- we have more notes to take! Failed to become a philosopher. It is a forbidden treasure that should neither be seen nor used. Should you seek it, visit me here. Forbidden treasure! Hi Hawkeye, welcome in! Welcome, welcome, and uh, Hawkeye, if you need to do post-raid stuff, post-stream relaxing, please do. Take care of yourself. We're learning about forbidden treasure. I am one who should not exist. I am hiding so as not to be found. I wait beyond the gate of no entry. I need to flip the page. Thank you everybody for the um, for the subs and bits. Here's your stickers. I'm gonna write on the other side of this. Oh yeah, I'm so glad they put that I'm finally, only like a year later, I'm finally used to the new shout-out button. But it has the follow button right there, and I'm like, oh yeah. Easy. Now I don't have to remember to do it after stream, and I always forget. 
Um, especially people who raid, like, thank you for bringing your people over here and for the support and checking in on the stream. Yeah, I forget to use it. It's a good tool, though. This is a They're giving me a riddle within the riddle. I'm hiding so as not to be found. I wait beyond the gate of no entry. Wait for nightfall in front of the statue that is unrelated to any of the puzzles and seek out the one who watches over travelers. Come to the gate of the night without being seen. Are you kidding me? That sounds like a stealth mission. That sounds hard. Miseroy, hi, how's it going? Welcome in. The statue that is unrelated to any of the puzzles and seek out the one who watches over travelers. Come to the gate of the night without being seen. Metal Gear Lameza, sneaking mission. <laughs> Pretty sure Lameza's response to a stealth mission is immediately blowing himself up with a bomb. Yep, that sounds about right. Oh my gosh. Uh, I'm good. Come to the gate in the darkness of night. I feel like I have that already. The gate in the darkness of night. Oh wait, I thought we were gonna poke our head into Hell Temple. <laughs> oh well. <laughs> I kinda got confused as to which one we were doing. We will. We'll poke our heads in. I don't have it activated. Unless this is all- unless this is... No. I don't know. Maybe they're related. If you have something you want to try, do that. Otherwise we can give you hint two. Well, I wanna go to the Nember Sky Disc. What this makes me think of is go to the Nebra Sky Disc and put, I guess, Moon, and then go to the different brother statues and, like, look at them and see who is watching over travelers, see who's unrelated to puzzles. Let me look at my, uh, obsidian notes. I guess I'm kind of tired of this song. <laughs> Just chilling here. Standing in midair. So the ones- if this is what the train of thought needs to be, the ones related to puzzles- here, let me show you. Are... Oop, I clicked out of it, hang on. Lido. Rebu? Because I think that's where we dove into the pot. I could be wrong. Miguela. 
G, Beto, Zebu, Fudo, Sakit. I think it's just a Budo that isn't associated with a puzzle. If you never hit the block in the mouth to activate the elevator, this entrance would have been impossible to enter. Well, is there a point at which you can't hit the block anymore? Okay, let's go on a little journey. The block vanishes instead and it's impossible to activate the elevator. Interesting. Okay, what is- I already forgot the warning. Don't save? What about auto-saving? Did I already ruin it? Nothing ruined. Okay, except for the ruins. Haha. <laughs> I'm doing it again. <laughs> Don't worry about my warning. That was for an old version. Oh, okay. I mean, better safe than sorry that I was asking about it again, but I'll try not to worry. <laughs> Okay, Fudo and Megala. Oh no, I gotta go to the- I said I was gonna go to the Sky Disc first, but I think it's already night. Because I'm pretty sure G is praying. When we walked through there, when I did the escape. Whatever you thought was ruinous may not have been. You've caused the ruins to collapse, you've ruined the ruins further. Your stuff is far more fixed than my folks believe. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Oops, I actually don't, oh, that was close. I don't want that elevator. Seek out the one who watches over travelers. Now, the other statues related to puzzles could be Tower of the Goddess. Because there's the whole... Eye of Truth thing. The different goddesses, statues that disappear. So that's on the back of my mind while we come and look at other stuff. Without being seen, though, I don't know what that means. On Wii, you actually had to download DLC to get any of this? Oh, interesting. Linux has the bug where if you land on a moving platform while stunned, you never unstun. Oh no. Okay. Was, was, was seen immediately. Do you play on Linux Steam? No. Nope. Windows. <gasps> I was seen. The ghosts saw me. The gate in darkness of night. I don't know, this doesn't seem very dark. Boogie, hi, welcome in. How's it going? I played four minutes and decided it was too hard. It's a... It's a game. Oh, I don't think you were even asking me. I think you were asking... 
asking chat, my bad. Did I already- did I already ruin it? Everything is still fine. Oh, maybe I gotta use the lamp of time to not be seen. It's an acquired taste a little bit. Okay, I'm going through the gate. Oh, I think everybody saw me. Oh god, they saw me! <laughs> I don't think that's what the hint means. How do I get up to that platform up there? Hmm... Okay, should I go to... Is... is... any of this mausoleum stuff... should I be in the mausoleum? Is... Uh, uh, um, do I need to... Do, what am I asking? <laughs> Hi Magus, welcome in. We beat her! It's over! We destroyed the ruins. I mean, they're still here right now, but... I could explain about the potential for ruining things. Well, I have a hard save file, right? So I'll ask, is... Can I... No matter what I do, can I go back to my... Like, load my save? And fix it? safe word and then should I stay in mausoleum safe word oh it wasn't even on any of these why is G praying is G always praying after you fight Sakit maybe no mausoleum okay I did save Mulbrook. Of course I saved Mulbrook. I learned that you cannot finish without saving her. There is no other exit. Is not where you should be. Mulbrook was saved. Okay. Let's try some statues over here. Hey. I mean, this makes a little more sense because of the the underwater room that I've been thinking about. Hey. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> We're just playing. We're just having a good time. First try Gendite steps away from Molebrook. Yeah, so however many attempts we did yesterday, we did one attempt today, died to the mother. Second attempt, beat her, and died steps away from Molebrook's room. And then third, we did it. And then people got Marduk stickers. Mulbrook saved you. True. All statues in Mausoleum were used in that puzzle to understand who is who, so the hint wasn't talking about any of them. I don't think the Abudo one helps you <laughs> tell who the other ones. I guess because it's not left-handed, therefore it becomes part of the puzzle. And because of the two groups of giants, I guess it becomes part of the puzzle. But there's really not much about that one. I guess just like putting a name to a statue could be considered the puzzle to finally figure out who they all are. 
It was sad to see the fall damage done might have been what killed you. I know. And I'm usually pretty good about going to see her and remembering my double jumps. But I got one of them and then not the second one or something like that. Anyway, it doesn't matter. The one on top of here is related to... I mean, it's not even there anymore. It's related to the entrance to Chamber of Birth. I feel like this one's related to the mantra. Yeah. Not a Metroidvania without an escape sequence. Yep. I was not entirely caught off guard, but I still was like, no, not an escape. I was hoping I was wrong. No, I'm still thinking about the wedges. We're gonna we're gonna give me a couple more days of grace to think about it, and then we're gonna talk about it on Sunday. There's no statue in this room. So actually there's not many statues left in here the big the big ones the weapon ones heavy foreshadowing for escape sequence exactly wedgies sunday cuz it's mother's day Hi, Coco Pup. Welcome in. Thanks for the lurk. I'm doing great. Good luck on dailies. Go, Lemeza. Swim. Oh. There's a ninja somewhere. Where's the ninja? Okay, I don't know. Not very many statues left here. Let me think about some more statues. There's the statue of the twins. There's several statues of the twins. There's... The statue on the surface. Um. Is there? Okay, let me look at my notes and see if I have anything with the word traveler in it. I don't think I do. Is there a room? Named after travelers? I don't think so. There's Village of Departure. Come to the gate of the night of... Of the night? Come to the gate in darkness of night. Gate of Departure? Without being seen... We are looking at, um, we're trying to find Mulbrook's dad.
Mother's split gate. Here's a gate. Okay, who do, are you? Can you see me? Does that bird seeing me count? Is it you? <laughs> okay, we're gonna get our next ad. What was the next? Somebody asked if I wanted the next clue. The wind is howling. Polishing the bald stone head with my souls. Um, before I get the next clue, does it have to do with the statues in Twin Labyrinth? Save for it. No, okay. Um, there's tons of statues in Temple of the Sun. None of them are super puzzly. Not as many statues in Temple of Moonlight. Not very many statues in dimensional corridor and this corridor is weird it has like eyeball statues i don't know gate of illusion has olmex graveyard has a million Giants, but it's like their bodies. I don't know that they're statues, you know what I mean? Inferno had a statue, but it's gone now. Shrine of the Mother had a statue, the dragon bone thing. Okay, is it in Tower of Goddess somewhere? But I missed it. But I'm not thinking of it. Safe word. Spring in the sky doesn't really have statues. No Tower of Goddess. Okay. Chamber of Extinction has murals and like elephant statues. Same with Chamber of Birth and Cogs of Soul everywhere. Trees of Life everywhere. Tower of Ruin has... Spirit seals. Is it the surface statue? <laughs> I don't think it is. Safe word, you can say if it is the surface statue. My hand drawn maps. They always are good at jogging my memory, except when they're not. It is the surface statue. Well, I was running out of statues, so that's good. Glad I came here on my own. After the statue clue from... Dracu Dracuet's grave. Maybe I should have paid it closer attention to the names of the rooms on the surface. Okay, we're getting... Hang on. We're getting timed out. Let me think about that on break. And we'll be right back. I need a, ba a bathroom break anyway, so that'll be good timing for me to brainstorm. <laughs> I'll see you soon. Thank you for the, the safe word answers. Appreciate it. I'll pick music too, of course. Of course. Okay, I confess though. I didn't really brainstorm. I got a Dr. Pepper out of the fridge. Half of one. I had the rest yesterday. Um. 
Breaks are good, but <laughs> sometimes I do completely empty my brain instead of brainstorming. What were we talking about? Statues and stuff. The surface. Oh yeah, the names of rooms on the surface. Now I remember. Let me get my surface map. This is good. We'll finally fill it out. Here it is. Alter Hill. We haven't used the colored pencils in so long. Dimensional corridor was mean because there were too many rooms and not enough colored pencils. I'm all the way over here. Like, I don't have anything really marked on here except for the background, the gate that you can see in the distance, and then the two chests and the seal over here, and then the seal over here. I have a few things. I wonder if we have to come out here through the extinction gate, but that, I don't know why that would be it. Alter Hill. Alter Hill. So this was supposed to be like a cool collaborative thing where you all talk to each other about all the hints. That's fun. I don't know. I guess if I knew anybody that was also playing this at the same time. Or I could have like saved it until we met somebody else who was finishing up a playthrough and we all could have collaborated together. I'm being selfish. This is called Outskirts. Oh, what was the one to the left? Cliff in front of the altar? That's why I didn't name any of these. Altar and Cliff in front of altar. It's kind of like if a lot of people throw their ideas against a wall, maybe one of them sticks. Did you all do it that way, or did you look it up? Which, what, how did you come across this? It's so hard to even find that room. Outskirts of... Village. Personally, no, of no instance that is not guided. Some of you were saying you saw, like, one streamer get it. If you're very observant, you can notice that the block in Guidance Space vanished. After Milbrook told you about her dad. Oh. Kitty Bard is the one that got it. That's cool. Outskirts. Oh, I always forget that's there. There's a wall. Village of Departure. The one who helps travelers. No, the one who watches over travelers. I wonder if any... I wonder if anybody here is part of this. I 
Adventure shop. Sell pud. Ammo shop. Gate of departure. That is here. Someone here is part of this. My money's on redacted. <laughs> Person I know who got it on their own also does MIT Mystery Hunt. Oh my god. I remember when I learned about that. And just thought it was the coolest thing ever. And I was like, I want to do one of these in my school. I was in middle school. Um, and my brother went to MIT. And he told, you know, told me about it. Told our family about it. I was like, this is so cool. Okay, this is specifically Mother's Split Gate. This room. Interesting. Not Gate of Departure. And this one is just called Entrance. I don't know if I have enough colors for this, so I'll write Entrance and then I'll keep going. But I don't know that I've ever been on the surface at a time when it was night, you know? Foothill. Just one little, one little square called Foothill. What's above here? Have I never been there? Don't answer that. <laughs> Or that's just another thing that overlooks once you get up to that big cliff. Sound Canyon. Okay. Sound Canyon. I swear my chair is extra noisy today. You all, I don't think you all can hear it. Can you hear it? This is also Foothill. That is a suspicious square, huh? Never noticed that square before. My chair, like, every time I lean forward to take notes, and then lean back, I feel like it makes noise. Can this be Foothill and Gazing Hill? Well, now we're gonna have lots of the same. It's probably fine. You can't hear anything? Okay. Sound Canyon. Huh. And what is that back there? The tower? Who are you? A 
if I jump down to the left, I could maybe end up here, but not here. Baroon's Waterfall. We do see this name. I was talking about I don't think I had seen it, but then I hadn't ruled it out because I don't have all the names memorized. That's cool. I don't have enough colors. This place has way too many names of rooms. Baroon! Baroon! We gotta chant it! Oh my gosh, what happens if you chant all the things by the people that their names are associated with? any higher than this, supposedly. Waterfall of the Goddess. So is this. And to get to the, the other ones, I gotta go back up. Okay, what? What's the next... Whoa, that was weird. The next nudge. After I'm done mapping these rooms. Oh, this is also Baroon's Waterfall. Baroon, what are you doing? Okay, I still have yellow I can use for a couple more rooms. Maybe I shouldn't have warped yet. I want to know what's going on with this tile that I don't know how to get to. It's weird, right? How do I make it nighttime? Do I have to like... damage boost off of a enemy to get up there. Sky in a tiny little corner of canopy. Oh, that's boring. <laughs> okay, then we mapped most of the rooms. Oh, I was gonna go to Extinction and go outside that way. Uh, what's the best way for me to do this? Oh, there was a noise outside. Um, I guess through here. Rude.
part of Pure Sky exists so maps all have the same size and tiles. I'm glad it doesn't mark what rooms you have or have not visited, because that would drive me crazy. I would be so mad that you can't visit that room. Okay, I'm going to Tower of Ruin first. Always, always get hit by that. Rude. Except this isn't the good way to get outside. Oh well, I'm doing it anyways. Okay, is it night time? Hi, Justin guy. Welcome in. How's it going? Seek out the one who watches over travelers. I don't know. I think I'm ready for the next nudge. I don't think coming here through a different area made it nighttime. I missed it, but I'm so happy for you. Thank you. I appreciate it. It was pretty cool. Yeah, safe word on the. I the I, I'm. Yes. Sorry. <laughs> Save word on the next nudge. It's gonna get pretty um, explicit. It can't be helped. Sleep before my stony gaze. I wish I had hair. Oh. No, it can't be helped. She's done safe word on any on everything, especially this now. Like. The fact that I know it's supposed to be a group puzzle, I just want to see it today, and so if I spend too long on it, we're already three and a half hours in stream. The the, the hype is dying. <laughs> and I thought we were gonna go, um... I thought we were gonna go poke our head into hell first. I'm, I, I thought we were gonna do that really quick and then start this puzzle. That is so wild. Does that happen anywhere else? I don't think so. Twitch removes new lines? Oh, for the haikus. Nice. This is so cool. Here's something to know. Look at this. Listen to the little nighttime noises. If you're seen by an unrelated NPC, you'll have to restart by sleeping here. Okay. That's not how it works. <laughs> See her? Thanks. There's that aspect too where I'm like gonna be safe wording a lot because it's something that I don't know. There's some contention. more and more confused during this playthrough. Ooh, what are some other confusions that happened? I'm curious about that. I just want to hang out here. This is nice. If you visit Zelput's screen or the two screens in the cave on the surface at Guidance, after re-entering the ruins, you have to restart by sleeping here.
Is there another noise in there too? I don't know what you're doing. This is trying to find Malbrook's dad. The game is so mysterious, even mechanics are unclear. Okay, let's go. I hope no one sees me. If you go to day surface, you have to make it night again. Oh. I sent them down a quick rabbit hole because there's a lot of misinformation about this puzzle being breakable and confirming that other sources are wrong. Interesting. Whoa, the block is gone. Walking through the path from Extinction to Inferno is fine and doesn't reset the puzzle. Weird. But this does. Cool. Okay. I just like the noises. It's calm and slightly spooky. Mm -hmm. What was the other, um... Don't... From that I gather, don't redacted the redacted. <laughs> I have to go back up. I wish I had hair. Sleep before my stony gaze. It was just the sleep thing that I needed. I wait beyond the gate of no entry. Seek the one who watches over travelers. Come to the gate in the darkness of night. But now I don't understand. But now I still don't understand what to do. <laughs> Hi, Jake. Kim. Welcome in. We're winning. We beat the game. It's not too weird. The puzzle is misunderstood. It's really easy to think the hint about being seen means more than it does. <gasps> it's fun. Finding out which screens are nighttime screens. Everybody's gone. What gate? They're all sleeping. This is so unexpected, unexpectedly nice. What I never knew I needed in La Mulana, a just tranquil nighttime scene. 
The only reason I know what I know is because I have a decode of the entire object flag scripting for the game ref to reference. Amazing. Reminds me of a warm summer night with a slight breeze. It's just missing fireflies. I wonder if anything else is is nighttime. It's kind of misty down here. Like any place besides the surface has nighttime screens. Is that the point? Am I supposed to get to Hell's Gate some secret path from here that doesn't go through? Gate of Guidance? I guess I could try it. No, you can't go through here. At night. We're not going to Hell's Gate. <laughs> My brain is so scrambled today. It's wonderful. So it's fun that I just mapped this out. And then immediately forgot everything. If I jump down here, does it turn to day immediately? No. The one who watches over travelers? Wah! Who's there? At this time of night? What? A word? What in the world is a word? Oh, actually, that sounds familiar. We have a whole slew of haiku to serve up? Oh my goodness. What in the world is a word? Seek the fairy at the depths of the bones that gaze upon birth. That's all I've got. This is fun. I like this puzzle. Even though I'm having to take a bunch of hints on it, it's really fun. It's the kind of stuff I like, you know. No fighting. Jacuit gave you one hint for two steps. I definitely did not think it was just go to Zelpud, clearly. Hi, Songbird. Thanks for the congrats. We did it. You have no clue what Zelpud is talking about here? Oh, the word? Or the fairy? One who watches over travelers is clearly a mistranslation. It should be old guy who trolls professors. The rug's gone, too. Is Zelpud wearing a face mask? Zelpud looking kind of ghostly. Are they just scared because I came in at night? New terror I've been missed it the whole time. Lemon chair is famous around these parts. No worries, though. I want to get a new fruit at some point. It is a face mask, yes. Now get out. I need to. I need at least twelve hours of sleep every night to maintain my beautiful skin. Okay, beauty rest. Get out. Can I come back here? Uh, safe word, can I come back to the nighttime scene anytime I want to? Oh, 
Or does it disappear after we finish this puzzle? Nighttime puddle bath? After you finish, you can't go back? No, that's the second time in like a half hour I've tried to walk through that wall. I have to keep this saved forever so I can come back. I haven't saved since we started doing this though. So whatever I do today is like post game, I'll save in a different file. Can you imagine? You've just spent an agonizingly long day, 16 hour day in the ruins. Some of it was muscling through, fighting skeletons, swinging your whip around. Some of it was pouring over all your notes and tablets and putting together hints and using your brain. Some of it was in Inferno and you were sweating bullets and, and distressed and you could barely see with the heat waves rising up. And some of it chilled to the bone in Graveyard. And you come back and you're finally done for the night. And you're just sitting in the puddle. It's nice and warm. It's just you. There's nobody else around. And there's these little like bats or something kind of chirping at you. La Mulana ambiance. Like, I want to keep this as a BRB screen or something. Hard save in a new slot, yeah. Put this as the last save file and return to the puzzle. I will! Oh, because you have to go talk to Dracuet first, obviously, to make this possible. Fancy. Yeah, I'm definitely keeping a save for this. And then you want curry. Oh, and then afterwards, you wrap up in like a super fuzzy robe and have a piping hot bowl of curry. Because you're starving after adventuring. Think about it. <laughs> okay, let's go. Um... Seek the fairy at the depths of the bones that gaze upon birth. There's birth chamber. There's stray fairy. There's the bone pit in Temple of Moonlight. I'm, I think I'm gonna start there. If you wanna make that, do you want me to make you a version of the graphics where the HUD is invisible? <gasps> yeah, I would just like, well. Sure, because then I have more options, but I'm gonna have to crop it to 16 by nine anyway. I wouldn't have to. There's lots of options. Hmm. You can push the HUD off the screen with HUD adjustment and settings. Oh, okay. All right, say goodbye to nighttime mode. That was lovely. Everything from here on out is jarring. <laughs> oh. Okay, here's a bone pit. Now, are these bones... ...gazing upon birth? That I don't know. Not really. 
But it is a... The depths of the bones. I don't, I don't think this is it. Unless I'm supposed to like go through this maze of a bone pile somehow. This is called Boneyard. Also, feels like it would be promising. Uh, do I have to bring a fairy here? Safe word. To that Boneyard. Because there will be a delay. Here's, here's Chamber of Birth. Are there any bones in here? Okay, no, I didn't think so, but like, I had to ask. Cause I thought of it. Maybe it is a thing. That gaze upon birth. It's cause it also says seek the fairy, not bring the fairy. But the stray fairy is gone. How long is this? How, what percentage of the way through this are we? Safe word. Is this a multi-stream puzzle? I get the sense that it could be. A third-ish? Dang. I did not know what I was getting into. I knew it was long, but not this long. Lots of haikus to go with it, though. That's fun. It's a long quest. Okay, can I ask another question not related to this? Is unlocking Hell Temple also a puzzle? Safe word? I, did I say safe word? If I didn't, I meant to say it. Like, also a different puzzle? Oh. Yeah, is it a different puzzle? That's what I thought. Is this all intertwined after all? It is a puzzle. Okay. That's why you all were being... You were not answering that earlier. Okay. Because I was like, oh, I wonder if they are intertwined and no one, you know, I didn't say safe word. It's all together. Fascinating. Well, then I couldn't have just poked my head in before starting this. What am I doing? At the depths of the bones. There's a bone. Gazing upon birth. But the fairy- so... I wonder if I'm not... She's gone. Am I supposed to find her somewhere else? She said she went to the heavens, right? She said... Stray fairy. I will go ahead of you to the heavens. I just assumed she was gone and I'd never see her again. 
Is there a haiku for this one too? The devs didn't want people to accidentally walk into Hell Temple. No. There are haikus for every step. That's so cute. Okay, what's the next haiku? Safe word. We're going to try to speed it along a little bit. Since I'm very clearly not going to solve this on my own. And the community already made some nice hints. This room is fun. Endless fighting room. So, uh... Yes? Yes, Petri? First you gotta go back to Zelput in the night, and then we can continue? Oh. I mean, cool, we get to go back to the night. Ready for the haiku? Yeah, did I... Is this another one of those weird things that I reset it somehow? What did I do, though? How do you know it got reset? Because the fairy wasn't there? You didn't, but the next step became inaccessible without resetting it? Okay, did I do it? Are we good? I don't drink a lot of soda. <laughs> but Dr. Pepper is so good. It's so, like, I, it's so addictive. Soda is incredibly addictive and I always feel it because I'm like, hmm, I feel like another sip. Mm, maybe just another sip. That was pretty good. <laughs> oh, I'm not that thirsty, but hmm, that sugar sure was good, huh? So what... This is a little frustrating because I don't know what resets it because some things that you said reset it didn't don't actually reset it. Origin of water looking down on a lost ship caving by a camp. Follow water's roar cozy nook above the gate. Hey, I know that boat. Going into the ruins resets night. But I thought we were done with night after we talked to Zelpud. How are you supposed to know that after you talk to Zelpud and Zelpud gives you a fairy clue that you don't go, okay, time to start the fairy clue. You're not. How did anyone, like, how did anyone... I'm, let's just, we're not doing puzzles. We're just going to the places. It makes sense people are just jumping the gun on things? Oh. Well, in any case. Okay, what was the haiku again? Came by a camp. Follow water drawer, cozy nook above the gate. Hey, I know that boat. Cozy nook above the gate. Oh, I don't have my map on here. Oh, and my chat got reset. There we go. Hi! Good 
good evening. I've heard about you from Master Dracuet. If you reset that and you go back to the to the original start in Gate of Guidance, does Master Dracuet at least tell you, like, something? Probably not. It's supposed to be super hard. Please take one of my people with you to the Shop of No Entry. Okay. You jot down a lot of notes. Yeah. That's kind of the point. There she is. After you enter the ruins and return to surface, it becomes day, but the puzzle needs to be done at night, so you need to restart from the sleep. I got that, but how are you supposed to know that both going to Zelpud and going to the fairy need to be done at night? Because once you go to Zelpud, Zelpud is like... Seek the fairy at the depths of the bones they gaze upon birth. What bone bones they gaze upon birth? Is it because of the software that you find here or something? Anyways. I know more, but that's all for now. Teehee! The, the tent contained a skeleton and gave you McCurry. Oh... And for the Dracula's hint about coming to him at night refers to the whole quest chain. It's seeming like it, yeah. Uh, the shop of no entry? And now she's gone forever. How do I get a fairy at night? Okay, what's the haiku for this part? And birth seal was a cross. Oh, that's cool. That's really cool. That's so cryptic. I love the hint for its absurd, absurdly obtuse nature, even if no one figures out what it means. I feel a little past the point of figuring it out what it means. Yeah, next haiku. Fairy helps thee, pierce lingering illusion, art thou still a fool? So are we done with the night part? Safe word? Okay, thanks, Red Sail. <laughs> that was my first thought. Now we're done with night scene. I was so sad to leave, and then it kept going, and I was like, wait a minute. I was sad for no reason. We're not even done yet. If you had to do a blind, it would take another 83 hours just to finish this part, yeah. I think if I had done this mid-game, it would have been like a little... It, this would have been a nice... The mantras are driving me out of my mind. Let's do this and drive me out of my mind with this instead. As like an optional departure from the plot. And then we could have kept momentum, but doing it at the end of the game is like, am I really invested in figuring this out on my own? No. Pierce lingering illusion. Art thou still a fool? Yes. Is there anything else I can do that resets it? Excuse me, okay. Also, she says bring one of my people there. I'm assuming it needs to be Key Fairy. Uh, 
A safe word. What's the? Sorry, so many pauses. What's the um? Is there a combo for key fairy? Warping inside. The only thing that resets is returning to the surface from this point. Okay. What's the combo for key fairy? Let me go find this. Oops. Claw Milana. Manual. Oh, we get to read the manual on Sunday. Miracle plus... You touch a tiny light. McCurry. Okay. I w that's... That's good. Uh... What else do I not want right now? I want everything! I want all the softwares! And we have an ad coming in four minutes. Doo -doo -doo. Okay, now how do I get to where I'm trying to get? Oh. If I fall down, right? Reloading the game doesn't interrupt it. Interesting. Thank you. It's strange that she's not included in the key lock achievement. And I swear I brought her here. But maybe I didn't stand here long enough. And also, um... Maybe it's only for this chain of events. It is I, Dracula again. Solve this riddle. Back in time you go. If you can do that, a new path should open. Come quick. Don't you want to see the treasure? You have to bring her during this process. Yeah, okay. And then we'll take our ad break. And yeah, that'll probably be the last break of the stream. I don't know, we'll see. I, here I thought we were going to have a short stream today because we finished the boss early, but... That is not the case. Come quick. Don't you want to see the treasure? We've got Sir Dob of Treasure. Back in time. We've got Gate of Time. Solve my riddle, streamer. <laughs> it's because you need to stay in step for the puzzle and because this was a DLC, so it's not seeing this as achievements. We're an intermediate next haiku. Oh, y yes. Yeah. I don't think I'll regret that. Come to the gate of night without being seen. Again? <laughs> In another time, offer self to heavens to continue hell's path. Okay. Time for a break and then I'll, and then I'll surely solve it. 
I surely will not just say, tell me what to do. <laughs> Be right back. What, mu what music do you want? Do we have requests? I turned this off, but I'll turn it back on. Mr. Explorer! Okay, you got it. I'll see you soon. This one... Bam. Welcome back, humans. I hope you had a good break. Um, yes, I can look for night. Would it be at the end? One thing you can look forward in Hell Temple is music. Oh my goodness. No night. Welcome back. Okay. Um, what was the, I already missed the haiku. In another time, offer self to heavens to continue Hell's path. Does it have to do with gate of time? safe word yes okay phew something in my brain for one of these puzzles pointed me in the right place although it literally says another time the word time oh I immediately went the wrong way too And what's the in-game clue? Don't you want to see the treasure? Come quick. Hmm. I always think that's gonna work and I should just use my shield. To the heavens. Okay, I have another question. Does come quick mean, like, I can run out of time to do this? Is this timed? I'm hoping not. Safe word. You can answer that. How do I offer myself to the heavens? Oh yeah, I forgot there's a bunch of, like, breakable walls in here, too. This is not. Oh, maybe. If I smack this enough times, it opens! Weird! Did I reset it? <laughs> I-I don't think so. I never did that before. Intended shortcut to get to Tower of Goddess early? Cool. That was such a strange place to, to pop out. Can get there without defeating Vi? Oh my god! Randomizer strats! I'm never gonna survive randomizer. What does it say? There's no way. You found a secret area! Hi, Raffle Iron. Welcome in. We've actually been here before. This is not my first time here. What is this? Why does that look like a door? It's a window. 
I'm glad you didn't find it when you explored Gate of Time for the first time. Stumbling into Unlit Tower of Goddess would have been confusing. For real? Where does this one come out? Anywhere? No, I don't think this is anything. Entrance is required knowledge for randomizer. Okay. What else? Let's, if there's no... How do I phrase this? If there's no puzzle spoilers, what else is... I'm curious what other stuff is going to be, like, randomizer required. Oops. Am I, am I going the right way? Do I need to stay in mausoleum? Safe word. Combine that with lamp glitch, you get flail whip in under an hour. Nice! Need to navigate all the way down to surface entrance screen in order to make it light up. Ugh. Oh, in the the GitHub GitHub wiki. Okay. You don't need to say. It. You're going the right way. Thank you. Getting aim and shoot with bombs. Fun. All the hidden boxes, including the one you had a feeling about in birth. Fun. Oh yeah, I don't think I ever bombed it. I was like, hmm, this sure is suspicious. This isn't a door, is it? No. Aim and shoot with bombs means glitch the puzzle because it's easier. <laughs> Offer self to the heavens. What does it mean? I guess heavens, I'm just going up and up and up. That's my only plan right now. I know, isn't it nice to finally be able to talk about it? Like, I, I Sunday, the plan is kind of just floodgates open. Within mod reason, because I don't want anybody to get too overwhelmed, like, with, uh, with modding and with chat flying and anything like that. But I think it'll be, I think it'll be pretty chill. By then I will try to sort out all my feelings about all remaining puzzles, come up with any last theories, and then I'm assuming I will not figure out the mantra thing so you all can finally, finally spoil that for me. Okay, I think this is as far as I can go. <laughs> Where am I supposed to go? Yeah, I think further hinting is necessary. I can't open my floodgates because La Mulana 2 is there existing. Fair enough. Hint, hot, cold, or just say. Go down the ladder. Wait, don't do screen by screen because that gets too confusing with, um, with delay. So, just tell me where to go. <laughs> Remember giving three lights to the heavens. Yes! Oh! Yeah, but it was over here. Jump up the ladder. Get to that screen from here. Jumping near the- from the bottom of the ladder? Oh, okay. Okay. Cool. Uh... Did 
didn't I have to light stuff though? Oops. The famous door. There is a door. Ah, nice. It is I, Dracuet. Jump into the huge casket. That's all. Hurry, hurry. Is there a haiku for this one? Walls relief crash down guardian's coffin before guardian's grave. There's only one thing that made me think of a casket. Doo -doo -doo -doo. The door, Narmer is giggling to himself at the thought of players trying to figure it out. If you thought this stuff was bad, wait for the next one. No. Okay, let's uh, let's go see Palenque. How do I get to this spot? This is the section where you have to jump down from Vi, right? Or, consequently, no. Never mind. You just have to jump down from Vi. This is wrong, too. Oh, you can get in there from Inferno. I just haven't done that in a really long time. There is an open door. Remember this fight? Remember the cool alien spaceship boss fight? That was a great- this- this was awesome. When we finally got to the Palenque fight. Cause Chamber of Birth- Chamber of Extinction took me forever. I was so stuck on this, the dumb dragon bone that I thought that I used and I didn't. Okay, that's not who I wanted to talk to. Wee! What the heck? Go down 19 screens? Are you kidding me? There's no way that I ever would have ever done this. Thank you all for helping me get here, even if it's taken three hours. No, not that long. Oh, I lost count. <laughs> oh no, we need to start over. Yeah. We're just gonna do this the whole way. Thank goodness for fairy clothes. Thanks, Jim. Thank you for the bits. You got a secret bit alert. I appreciate it. Thank you for cheering for humanity. What? 
This is ridiculous. <gasps> Yay! But I like this part. I can't open this from the other side. I can only come in here this one time. I commend you for reaching me. The gate I am at has been opened, leading to the place of no entry. A treasure that should not be seen, a treasure that should not exist. Only those with the strength to make it this far should witness it. Now you just gotta find it. It's not just next to Hell's Gatekeepers? Okay, hang on. I, I did say, like, it's totally fine for people to share the haiku, but I'm afraid it's gonna get lost, because I'm gonna write this down really quick. I'll, I'll, I can always scroll up. <laughs> How dare streamer have to put in work scrolling through chat <laughs> I'm overthinking this a treasure that should not exist only those with strength to make it this far Should witness it. Confusingly, Hell's Gatekeepers have nothing to do with Hell Temple. Skip to Haiku! Give me one second. Now head to the gate, but there's no gate to see because it was me all along. I know you're all probably thinking, why is she writing this down? She's never needs to get a control F search it later, but I want to have it for the record, for the archives. Next April 1st, the zero, the Xeroth cat makes Hell Temple be at Hell's Gatekeepers. <laughs> we st we skip telling you the haiku because the lava was too cursed to not spell it out. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That was the right call. <laughs> it was me all along. It's actually Mulbrook. Where have I seen- have I ever seen this symbol before? Hmm. Okay, now I can scroll up. Where it all began, offer yourself to heavens. Hell spiral awaits. Need to pass pure lava to go to a pool. Gets progressively more obscure until you reach this BS. Yeah, really. Okay, this one has a haiku too. No, that's the one you already gave me. Yeah, that's not the one about the pool. What's the one for the lava pit? Courage to sink, keep score for a score, strike right, complete the warm right. Wow, 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 wow. I 
I keep missing it. Where is it? Where it all began, offer self to heaven's hell spiral awaits. Where it all began. I'm gonna run out of flares. all began here. I don't know. Head to the gate, but there was no gate to see because it was me all along. It was me all along. And where everything began for this puzzle was gate of guidance so I could head back there It was me all along. Let's use the warp to go one screen down. This is where it all began. Jackson. Welcome in, Raiders. Thanks for stopping by. Um, I cannot go in this door anymore. Twitch gonna twitch. Always. Okay. Well, um, Similarly obscure like the other steps. Yes, I would like another hint. Is it Mulbrook? Safe word? <laughs> I don't think it's Mulbrook. But that would be very funny. Oh, I guess it is. That is where it began. She's the one who gave us the first hint. No. Zelda is nice, though still at the tutorial equivalent to the Great Plateau. Nice. Very cool. I'm excited. Happy Tears of the Kingdom weekend. Okay. Yes, safe word, I'm ready for the next hint. It's Everything is obscure, and I'm not meant to find this place. It's supposed to be super hidden. Repeat what you did in the gate of time. Uh, wow. Yeah, that's so hidden. I never expected there to be that much stuff in gate of time, but it turns out there's tons of stuff in there. Oh, I don't have my shield equipped. The snakes with arms are back! Oh, wait, what? Repeat what you did in Gate of Time. An actual gate of guidance? What do you mean? Just... It's only hidden for those that never played OG. Amendus is my brother! Oh, cool! Hi, nice to meet you. And then non-gate of time, gate of guidance. Jump up the ladder into the wall. 
Oh. Wait, so why did you say gate of time? But not in gate of time. I just misread it. I'm so sorry. I don't know why I'm sorry. I just completely read the sentence as... Repeated in Gate of Time. There it is. Ah! Now you can save if you want to. No. I don't want to. Uh, can you, um, warp here with the Holy Grail? Good luck and don't feel like you actually have to do this if you don't want to. Thanks, Siri. Thank you for the help. Thank you so much and for the clarification with everybody giving hints and everything. Welcome to hell. The music's good. The door and gate of time was the way to enter original hell temple. Oh, that makes sense. Okay. A totally original tile set. The Guidance Warp is just there. Okay, cool. There's Beholdening! Oh my god, the last Beholdening? You know how- you know how to bring me joy. Oh, pff, I took off Reader. Should I decode it one last time? I took off Reader so that I could have Miracle Mirai. Miracle something. Welcome to Hell Temple. Behold! A place that one ought not enter. Proceed only if you won't regret seeing whatever lies ahead. This is Hell Temple. What more can you expect? It's literally hell in here. Terrible. Okay, I gotta go save. It seems like a nice place. God, that was so much work. I'm not saving over that file. And I'm not saving my over my original day one. So one one and three three are off limits. Let's do one, two. Where's my save? My save file cheat sheet. I feel like I need a new one. Three dash three before mother night music still possible and one dash one original first save and one dash two hell Kaizola Mulana. No! <gasps> Night music should be possible in every save with all guardians defeated? Okay. Well, I don't. I would. I'm just gonna keep it as that one. <sighs> this seems fun. There's a block labeled zero. Is that like number of attempts or deaths or something? I guess we're about to find out. One. You know, it's the room numbers or something?
I can't iframe through you. Oh, yes, I can. Okay, fun. Love it. There's no exit. Maybe. What are all these switches for? My computer doesn't like this area. Ooh, no, no, no. Okay, it has woo 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 noises. I like it. <laughs> None of that. They're always blocked. Some of them are just empty. Some of them have flaps. Some of them are false switches that you shouldn't press. <laughs> oh, and there's ninjas. Get out of here. <laughs> Hell. Where's that clip of me saying, this is the worst room in the game? Okay, but if you finish Hell, do you get the special clothes? Probably not. Probably just, good job, you did it. Maybe there is no finishing it. I didn't say safe word, you're right. I haven't decided yet. Ooh. And there's ninjas. Of course there's ninjas. Wonderful. Okay, bye. You know what I like better than hell? The puddle. You know what I like the most of all? Can we get the music glitch here? Come on, come on, come on. It's select and close at the same time, right? Maybe I'm forgetting what buttons to press. Since you're looking what is and will not go complete wants to know the worst part of that. Uh, I guess? I don't know. What if I do want to decide to complete it later? Thanks for the joy. Puddle joy. Okay, well at least just give me the music. I can never figure out quite how I get this glitch. I want the music! Come on! I wonder if it can't be on the repeat button? I got it, like... 
There we go. I was like, I got it once super early on. It doesn't feel like exactly the same time. I feel like slightly offset. Your Steam trading cards for La Mulana might contain Hell Temple spoilers? Interesting. Interesting. Um, I think Hell Temple is not something I will stream. But maybe if I'm really missing this game, I might mess around with it. It feels like, um, potentially what Colosseum was for me in Ho Hollow Knight, the third level, which I never finished, but I streamed it for like hours saying I'm gonna finish Colosseum, I'm gonna finish Colosseum, it's gonna happen, and then eventually I was like, oh, you know, I don't know if it's gonna happen. <laughs> so I might like try it out until I get too salty about it. Um, okay. Thank you. For hanging out with me today thank you for the raids thank you for all the love let me show you the hype train stickers again all of our marducks this was really cool we will be back sunday if you have any recommendations of stuff to do or suggest um if spoiler chat wants to conference about it any questions you're dying to ask? Yeah, I don't know. Um, not right now. Do you think I should watch the lore video before Sunday? Or save that for, like, the very last thing that I do? I'm glad you've witnessed the process of opening Hell Temple. It's wild. It's so overwhelming. I think that would have been incredibly... Even though it would have been a departure from the main game and a break... I think it would have been incredibly frustrating streaming it because I would have been more stubborn about it and like, no, I want to figure it out. And it, it's not, it's not really figuring it out. It's like having enough people to narrow it down. Seems like the strategy. It's a long string of how the hell were you supposed to figure that out? Exactly. Enough tries of enough different areas of like, oh... The bones looking across the way from the birth seal. Oh. But how many people did it take to get to that? Thanks, everybody. Thanks for the GGs. And the well done. And the congrats. That's why we didn't try to offer it. Yeah, exactly. And I got so frustrated in parts of this game where it felt like I was asking for a nudge and then immediately, like, stuck again and needing an feeling bad about needing another nudge, so that would have probably been the same thing for Hell Temple. Um... Yeah, Sunday should be fun. I don't know how long we'll go... I don't know how much, like, in-game stuff we'll see, so maybe we play some more Hell Temple, because it'll, like, telling me solutions to things won't require that I go in-game to do them. If there's any hidden or missing items, but there's not. I got the weapon I was mess missing because I needed to get it. And, oh, there's a seal missing. Spirit seal. Maybe. Don't answer that. Thanks, Dama. Thanks for the congrats. I got all the software, so we don't need to go do that. We talked about the shield, so we don't need to go do that. Yeah, interesting. The solution is to get an infinite number of monkeys playing an infinite number of copies of La Mulana, and eventually, one of them will stumble upon the answer. Truly. I know at least one in-game thing we should do. Okay. Could learn how to clip through floors. Okay. We could talk about randomizer. If I'm uh, ambitious, I can try to ask one of you to help me set it up. Um, I'm sure it's not too involved, right? <laughs> anyway, let's, uh... Let's save? This will still be the Hell Temple save, but I'll just be at the surface now. Learning raindrops and cat pausing would be fun. Let's do it. 
I like it. What we did after I beat Super Metroid for the very first time was a stream of learning stuff like that and setting up the randomizer and showing some things, some moves in game that I didn't know how to do. What was another game we had like a post game stream of? Um, I don't know. I tried rando once, but I forgot to check the setting that lets you start with Grail. Ah, <laughs> I was wondering about that. I refuse to do it without. Oh my gosh, I can't believe it's over. I'm gonna miss it. 